this is the first time when we are showing a 16 Pax UI software. So this is a real phone software, which is on my PC. I'm just using this kind of a display to show that. It's then up to the licenses to show the actual device, how it looks like and, and what are the uh, final graphics and, and things like that. Uh, so <laughs> all of the... All of the Functionalities are not yet in the demo, but I can show you what is the idea, how, how the interaction goes. So if you tap clock icon, you can go to the clock application, or then you can quickly change the different profiles from the status area. And naturally, um, other family A60 functionalities are similarly uh, available, available from the screen. So if we go to the contacts, uh, you can scroll lists uh, quickly with this kind of a gesture interaction. Uh, and the more you have content, and if you keep scrolling, it accelerates the scrolling. So it's quite practical in that sense. And, and then if you have a 30 names starting with F and 30 names starting with H, uh, you see the character on top, uh, on front of the name, so that you can jump in al alphabetic groups. So it, it's uh, making it even faster. <laughs> uh, then if we go to the web application, if there's a similar thing that you can just scroll on the web page so that uh, you can quickly see where is the, uh, what, what the page look like and you can navigate to the different links. <coughs> Same thing with uh, images, so let's go to the images. Uh, there, and then the image. So now it opens to the different screen resolution. Uh, so you can make a gesture and it, it opens the next next image. So that's the idea. Small demo effect. Works like that. But really the idea is to, to keep this uh, user interface as familiar as possible because uh, already 150 million users know how to use S60 UI so they can easily take also the touch version into use. And naturally we are, we are still supporting the traditional soft key based interaction so this gives more alternatives for the end users and for the licenses so that they can do uh, different kind of a devices and they can choose the type of touch device they really like to have. Uh, so actual device can then look very different. Uh, they might be devices with this kind of just a couple of uh, hardware keys or they might be touch devices with full Verti keyboard or with D9 keyboard and so on.